Let's give them something to talk about. Oh, oh my goodness. Y'all so sneaky. Oh my goodness. Trues. Is that? Is that the Trues? Hey, True family. It's Miss True Redbone. And I'm back with another one. Hey, what happened today, y'all? What happened today? Today, we hit a thousand subscribers, yes! <laughs> Woo! But we finna talk about strong mommy Chrissy. I'll be right back. Yo. Yo. It's dead in this town. You know? It's crazy. Gotta shake things up. Yeah. For real. Let's go. Quiet night. There is no sound. Who needs a light? With no final round. Let's talk about sex, baby. Ha! <laughs> All right, y'all. So, I saw it just like you saw it. You saw it and you saw it. Strong mommy Chrissy cut up that man ish. Yes, she did. But seriously. Get that bad juju out your house, baby. Um, I don't know if that's the way that you should have went about it, but that's your business, how you handle it, long as you get that negative energy out of your surroundings. Um, I don't know if Strong Mommy Chrissy will ever see this, but this is for you, boo. I did a video for you yesterday. Check it out if you ever get to see it. Um, not bashing or anything. It's truly authentic and from a woman to a woman. I looked up a affirmation for this because there is a off there is affirmations for anything you guys so let me go ahead and read this one for y'all okay some people some people will better your life by being in it while others will better it by staying out remember you can't improve your life if you are surrounded by negative fucking energy get it out y'all that only brings you down. Again. Look, I'm rolling my eyes. Again. You cannot improve your life if you are surrounded by negative energy. That only brings you down. Get the negative energy out your lives, y'all. We don't need it. It's, it's a burden that... It's a heavy load to carry. If, 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 if it don't feel right, get it away from you. If you, every time you come around this person and there's negative energy, make sure you get that out of your universe, y'all. It's weighing you down mentally, physically, and emotionally. She did the right thing by getting his things out of her space. Now, the way she handled it, handled it is her own business. I'm not condoning the way she handled it, but that strong mommy Chrissy business right there, she did, she took the right steps for her to get on a healthy a healthy a healthy track so she can get that that bad juju get it out it was bad when it was there and now that it's gone you need to go ahead and get that ish out your out your life out your kids life out your mom's life out of your house so you did the right thing don't take none of that energy with you when you move into your new place that's first and foremost She wasn't playing, y'all. She wasn't playing. Did y'all see Strong Mommy Chrissy with them scissors trying to cut up them little shoes? I would have put, you know what? I would have put that stuff on Poshmark and got my money back. Because y'all know she bought it. It's, she bought, she probably bought it for him. You know what I'm saying? Why not recycle? Get your money back, girl. Put it back in the house for, for them kids, you know? But by any means possible, you did the right thing by getting that negative energy out your house. It will weigh you down. It will stress you out and you don't need it. Y'all know what I heard. That what I found. I, I heard something today that I just thought was. I ain't even gonna go there. But what I heard was that um she looked tired. Yeah, she looked tired. She is tired. She damn near nine months pregnant. She has to provide. Y'all know I'm driving. She has to provide and care for 
eight children right now. Um, so she has a lot on her plate. Um, I know she has an upcoming C-section coming up and I pray to God that someone steps in and helps her um, with, I know her mom is there. I don't know how much mom can do. Um, but if you need me, boo, call me. I'll come help you out. No, I won't. I'm sorry, y'all. I got on this mic and I'm probably messing up everything. I'm sorry. No, I won't. I'll take it back. I don't like kids that much. Mm -mm, that's too many. My nerves bad. You know, my, my nerves get bad. I'm sorry I'm getting older. But if you need some other kind of help, let me know. Hit me up. My uh, email is in the description box at all times. Um, but yeah, I hope somebody there has helped. To, it, it, somebody steps in to come and help her so that she doesn't feel like she needs to rush and get up and try to take care of everybody you know what i'm saying that's gonna be a lot plus she's moving plus she's gonna have to you know get, mm, that's a lot to have to do move unpack babies you know you're gonna have to grocery shop clean all of that that's a lot i hope she either hires if she's able to hire somebody to come in and help her i hope she takes advantage of that or if she has someone that volunteers that she can trust to come in and help her because she needs help that's gonna take some help especially while she's trying to heal now after she heal y'all know strong mommy chrissy can handle it so i'm sure that she'll you know bounce back and get back in her groove of things but i just thought that was really unnecessary to say that she's tired it's it, it's a it's a given she's exhausted she's probably not sleeping well you know she's not sleeping well because she's still trying to to um figure this whole thing out in her head but baby girl said two tears in the bucket fuck it i am i am um taking i'm taking my i'm trying to think of the word y'all i'm taking me back i'm gonna get rid of all that belongs to the past and i'm starting a new fresh positive energy all around and hats off baby you can handle it people you know i had so many comments all, all were i didn't even get any rude comments i had plenty of good comments and you know they were just saying you know it's gonna be hard yeah it's gonna be hard it's always hard being a single parent it's going to be hard but where there's a will there's a way she can she can do this she can set her mind to it and handle this i just hope um that she sticks to her guns and does not and does not take him back um he's a burden on you baby you handling your business keep doing what you've been doing he was only back for three months because so he could you can't be missing out on too much he was gone you know you can't be missing out too much hopefully she'll swiftly get over this and be okay i know she'll be okay but you know what i mean um let's see she said he she said he left and he didn't care about her or those kids so i gotta you know i'm gonna i gotta get this this anger this fire out of me so what what other better way than to do it than to to cut up or set on fire or bleach some shit you know what i'm saying by any means possible get it out your get it out your area get the bad juju out you did the right thing i'm proud of you for that um trying to make sure that i'm not I, but i personally and you know i like money so i would have just sold it i would have sold the stuff or i would have um not, not necessarily sold it i would have donated it why not as long as it's out of my house i would have donated it somebody else could have used them because they looked semi like some some good you know upkept shoes and stuff like that and i'm sure some little kid could have wore his sweaters they look small enough you know you gotta be open-minded <laughs> y'all we hit a thousand subscribers today i am pumped i'm finna grind if y'all did that one grinded before y'all that was just me you know on the regular that's how i move anyways but from this point on this right here this shit right here it's going down it is i am so grateful y'all y'all don't even know i can't even put it in words for you i can't 
But what I am going to say is, tell your mama, daddy, sister, brother, auntie, uncle to come by here and see Miss True Red Bone. I'm not a secret. Share, share, share. Share my videos. I do not care. And round of applause for the true family because y'all got me where I'm at today. It takes two. It takes me and you. <laughs> y'all have a blessed rest of y'all evening. If I can go live, I'm going live, y'all. No joke. <laughs> maybe tomorrow but thank you guys for hanging tough with me keep coming back we we gonna it gets greater later and y'all have a blessed evening i love you guys peace